Hey guys, Brian here with another first world problem. My problem today is my batteries weren't charging. So when I'd start up the boat, Yamaha FSH, I'd get a voltage error despite charging it uh, all night. And so I was wondering what was happening. I get in and I start digging around and lo and behold, Yamaha on my VSR here, it was tucked up in the back, but they didn't connect the lead that says must be connected to the battery negative to power the unit. So the VSR wasn't uh, switching the batteries and getting a charge uh, properly. So all I'm gonna do is hook this lead up to the negative side here, which will power it. I'm assuming it's wired. I'm not gonna pull all this apart to make sure it's wired right. I'll at least assume they did that properly, but then uh, I should be able to charge both banks uh, the VSR will sense, you guys can watch videos on this, but the VSR will sense that this battery's uh, charged, then we'll flip the switch and allow the uh, alternator to charge the starting battery. But otherwise, I was getting a low voltage here on it. So, hope that works and helps you guys out. But again, check the wire was tucked up underneath. Make sure your negative terminal, terminal is connected uh, to your VSR. Hope that helps. All right, we're all attached. Here's the uh, VSR cable now attached to the negative on the starting battery. And I can tell it's working now because for the first time I have the LED light. So my VSR is now working, should charge up both batteries. It already sensed the one battery was full, turned on, switched the charge. So now I don't need to switch my terminals. Before I didn't know what was happening so I was switching my, my charger from battery to battery but now this should make sure that they're both charged when we're running and uh, avoid that low voltage air that you might be getting on your Yamaha FSH. Hope this helps.